When she's not helping the Texas women's basketball team win a Big 12 championship or appear in the NCAA Elite Eight tournament, Aaliyah Moore is a junior at the University of Texas at Austin. And in class this week, she says she found out her professor was fired. And she's one of the few black professors at the school. And so to know a black professor and she's a woman, I was like, this is amazing. Like, I, I can connect with her. She understands. We've reached out to that professor but haven't heard back. Her losing her job comes on the heels of reports of as many as 60 UT professors fired and the university shutting down its division of campus and community engagement at the hands of Senate Bill 17, the state's ban on diversity, equity, and inclusion initiatives in higher education. Why was this something that was ever even brought up and why do they think that we already have enough on this campus? Because I go here every day and that is not true at all. You know, that's a great question and I would say that if I could pull all the students together for a great big conversation on why. Today we spoke with State Senator Brandon Creighton, the author of Senate Bill 17, the DEI ban on the UT campus. This is a first-hand experience of a, of a Texan, a Texas student. Of course you're going to have very personal relationships regardless of performance, right? That's a person-to-person -person relationship that's not based on performance or how they're doing at their particular job and the personal aspects of that uh, is always very difficult when there's change but we cannot hold Texas public universities back because of hurt feelings or a change in employment uh, or a one-on-one -on -one relationship. If we hear similar stories from other universities, you know, similar numbers, 60 professors, 60 faculty members oh, yeah. um, out of jobs, you would say this is, this is the intent of the legislation. This is the direction that we want to go in. Absolutely. This doesn't mean that universities won't be seeking diverse outcomes. This means we're getting rid of a model that does not work. I think we were making small steps in the right direction and this just put us back. And I think they need to hear from students on this campus to see how it's really affecting us. And it's not, again, just affecting black students, it's affecting us as a student body. Thank you for watching. Please hit the subscribe button and get the latest news by downloading the CBS Austin News app.